The mixer gives access to live's volume, pan, mute, solo, arm and sense controls as well as the crossfader and AB controls. A mixer menu on the side allows you to select the controls you want to use. By tapping the mute buttons, you can mute, unmute the corresponding tracks. By dragging the buttons left and right, you can scroll through the tracks of the live set. You can increase or decrease the amount of tracks in the view by using the zoom buttons in the button bar. Next to zoom, the icon shows if relative faders mode is activated or deactivated. In this mode, the faders will not jump to the position of the finger, but will increase or decrease relatively to the amount the fingers moved. The 0 dB lock prevents your volume faders from going over 0 dB. If the icon is turned blue, 0 dB lock is active. The last icon in the bottom bar hides the mute buttons from the track sections and resizes the faders accordingly. Note that if the mute are hidden, you will have to use clips or devices module to scroll through your tracks. Tapping quickly twice on the top part of the fader will bring its value to the maximum. Same for reaching quickly the middle value and minimum value. Bring up the crossfader by tapping the crossfader icon in the mixer menu. The mixer control section will resize and the crossfader module will be shown. It contains the crossfader itself, buttons for center, left and right position, and a button to toggle the AB control section. If you tap the AB toggle, the AB controls for each track will be shown. Set them by tapping on A or B. Tap on the multi-controls icon to add as many controls as you want in the same view. All of them will be shown for each track. Select all the controls that you want to show in the view by tapping them. If they are selected, they will turn blue. As long as you add new controls, the previous controls will be resized and the chosen control will be added to each track. You can toggle, untoggle each of the controls independently. After the initial setup, you can switch between single and multi-controls per view at any time. If snap mode is activated, all controls would jump back to their previous value after being released. To activate and deactivate snap mode, press the lock button on the sidebar. Snap mode can be quantized and synced to the current tempo. To apply a quantization, open the transport bar and tap the quantization menu icon, then set a value. In full view mode, the mixer offers a range of different functionalities, which can be accessed by tapping the button on the bottom right corner of the mixer view. Double mixer mode shows twice as many tracks using two rows. Dual mixer mode shows the same area of tracks with separate controls for each module. Big Mixer Mode maximizes the length of the faders using two rows, useful for fine-tuning. 